I feel like a lot of people are just starting to learn about the Hasbara handbook and they're completely shocked. Now, if you don't already know this, the settler colony known as Israel has a book. It's called the Hasbara handbook, okay? Basically, it gives Zionists a pathway to how to deal with pro-Palestinians, Palestinians, and anyone who's not entirely aware of the occupation that's been going on since, you know, before 1948. There's ways that they deflect, there's ways that they're supposed to say things, how they're supposed to shift the conversation. Let's go through just a smidge of the Hasbara handbook. So this post kind of quickly sums up what we're all feeling. So if you're newly plugged into Palestine and seeing the Israeli propaganda machine for what it is, know that you're not losing your mind. The absurdity, the lack of logic exercised by Zionists is a deliberate tactic. This is why we don't engage. Nothing is said in good faith. We don't engage with Zionists because they do not debate. They follow this Hasbara handbook, okay? They've been trained on how to deal with us in such a way to waste our time and distract from the reality, which is Israel is a settler colony committing massacre after massacre against the Palestinian people. Okay, so the Hasbara tracker goes through this. This is the method of advocacy encouraged by the Israeli state and its supporters. This is used to make it look like they're having a genuine debate whilst also avoiding the debate. The strategy is to say nothing. So yeah, for those who think that this has been going on since October 7th, the Israeli state published this back in 2002. Let's go through their method, this point scoring method. Point scoring is a method of communication that prioritizes making certain points favorable to the speaker and attacking opponents of the speaker by trying to undermine their positions. So this is the important one. Point scoring communication ought to give the appearance of a rational debate whilst avoiding genuine discussion. The aim of the Israel activist point score is to try to make as many comments that are positive about Israel as possible whilst attacking certain Palestinian positions and attempting to cultivate a dignified appearance. This is literally in their Hasbara handbook. Point scoring works because most audience members fail to analyze what they hear. Rather, they just register only a few key points and form a vague impression of whose argument was stronger. The Hasbara handbook even tells you when, when to use the point scoring method. When the audience is only partially engaged. They've been doing this for years and training people how to debate us for years. How to score points whilst avoiding debate. Audience members can be alienated by undisguised attacks, so all point scoring needs to be disguised. So Zionists are taught to say, well, that's not really the right question. I don't think we should be focusing on dot dot dot. The real point is that dot dot dot. That's an interesting point, but I don't think we can really begin to address it before we think about dot dot dot. Isn't some of this sounding really familiar? But wait, there's more. You seem to assume that dot dot dot, an assumption that's impossible to share. Really, we need to consider dot dot dot. They'll usually insert some BS like a two-state solution here. And basically, these are examples to give the appearance of addressing what was said. So I just want you all to be aware that Israel has been doing this for years. Israel has been employing people to literally troll us and waste our time for years, okay? They put millions into programs every year to get people to take down our videos, take down our posts, sit there in our comments and harass us, literally waste our time utilizing the Hasbara handbook and repeating the same nonsense over and over and over again. So you're not losing your mind. It is literally a tactic that Israel has been using against the pro-Palestinian community for years. And this is one of the main reasons why we do not engage with Zionists. You cannot change their mind. Their ideology is set. 
And even if you could, the majority that we're seeing come in our posts and our comments and everything, they're paid trolls. They're getting paid money to do that. So do not waste your time because you cannot speak logic to racists, to supremacists, to people who are literally celebrating the genocide of the Palestinian people. Get involved in direct action. And as always, free Palestine.